What's going on? This is Abdul Houthi right here, aka Atufit, and today I'm gonna to be sharing a very easy diet. Actually, the easiest diet I've ever tried in my entire life. I lost a lot of body fat with this diet, and I didn't feel deprived or hungry. And I honestly, I didn't even feel that I was dieting in the first place. So I'm gonna be sharing a lot of secrets with you in this video. Make sure to check out the entire video. It's gonna be full of information. Guys, before we start, please, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up so that more people can watch it. Don't be a hater and give it a thumbs down. Don't be full of bigotry, bigotry. And also guys, if you want me to help you create a full plan for you, a workout and a meal plan that doesn't make you feel hungry, deprived all the time, feel free to check out my website. I will have it linked in the description box down below. Without further ado, I got a text message. Let me check it and let's get on with the video. Okay, so my main goal for me is to reach 2,300 calories to cut. I will show you how you can do it on my website right now. Let's go. Go to my website, guys. You type in add to fit, add to fit dot net, add to fit dot net. And then you will wait for it until it launches. Wait one second, I'm holding the phone like this. And so add to fit dot net, there's a calorie calculator here. Uh, basically, you can go right here. You can, here are the results right here. So for me, basically to lose fat, I need 2,356 calories. Uh, and I also break it down to protein, carbs, and fats. How, how many proteins, carbs, and fats? Okay, so first meal or a breakfast. What I have here is one tortilla. It's uh, very light and big in size, which is good. It goes on with what I eat here. I usually have like five eggs, uh, sometimes four. I don't have a lot of eggs, like two whole and uh, three whites, sometimes two whites, but I make sure to have two whole eggs. And right here is my personal favorite, the cute oats. And I use uh, the stevia to sweeten it up like this, okay? Stevia from Fibrelli, this brand is available in Libya, you can check it out through Add to Nutrition and it's available in Turkey. It's also available in the US, it's like a really, really good brand. It tastes just like sugar. Anyway, I will make sure that to link the macros and the calories from this meal and put in mind that my goal is 2,300 calories, might be a little different for you according to your measurements, your height, weight, your general goal. So make sure to always calculate your calorie, calorie, uh, daily, daily caloric intake, daily caloric intake. Let's go, guys. Okay, so now I'm gonna enjoy my first meal of the day. Let me enjoy it in peace, please. I'm kidding. And uh, after that, I will show you uh, what kind of snack do I have. I usually have coffee. Sometimes I have tea, and then I enjoy a snack. Yeah, I enjoy snacks too. I have like a chocolate bar, chocolate bar. Yeah. Uh, I'm really enjoying my life in this cut and I'm seeing a lot of good results so make sure to stick to the entire video to stick through the entire video I need an English teacher after these uh, vlogs honestly okay so one hour after my breakfast sometimes 45 minutes I take a coffee Sometimes I add a little bit of almond milk to it. You saw the whipping machine that makes it look like whipping cream a little bit. It adds a little bit creamy texture to the coffee. It's really good. And uh, I take 70% or 80% dark chocolate. Uh, I have dark chocolate available at the nutrition. You can check it out if you're in Libya. Sometimes you can have any kind of protein bar as long as it has low sugar. Uh, you can have anything with high fiber content in it. For me here, basically, I think I'll try to include the macros from this snack as well so that you can be aware of the total caloric and macros intake throughout the day. I will link it down below so you can check it out. But basically here uh, I have like 20 grams of fat which is probably uh, 180, 180 calories, yeah. 
kind of 180 to 200 calories from this meal in total. I will have my snack while I'm working and then I will have another meal like a pre-workout meal. Uh, I will show you this meal before going to the workout and then after the workout I still have another meal. So it's pretty fun. This whole freaking diet thing you won't even feel like you're dieting or you're being restrictive or anything. You're just eating constantly which is something really really important for people who diet because a lot of people they just eat like two or three meals and then they get hungry and then they get this desire to really go outside and mess up their meal plans and to eat sugary stuff and this is another topic for another video later that's why i tell you make sure to subscribe and like this video so that you can keep up with my upcoming videos as well let's go okay so this is the pre-workout meal i don't know third meal of the day or second meal considering if I'm gonna count the snack as a meal or not I don't know but anyway I have like basically 80 grams of oats so the total here the total macros that I have is like uh, 5 grams of fat 45 grams of carbs or 50 and 10 grams of protein I'm gonna consume this and then like 30 to 45 minutes later I'm gonna head off to the gym should I take you to the gym with me or not Okay, I will do that. Uh, if I have uh, the ability to film what I'm gonna work out, I will, but like honestly, the workout is not very necessary for me. The most important thing that I wanna share with you is the nutrition in this video. Okay, guys. Okay, so uh, 30 minutes, 45 minutes before the workout, I have one or oh, two scoops of BCA basically. You can have whey protein, you can have any source of amino acid. It's not really important what kind of amino acid, but I think the cheapest would be like protein, whey protein or isolate. So I took two scoops of BCA and I'm about to hit the gym. Okay, so now it's gym time and I'm going to be doing chest, a little bit of uh, shoulders. I'm gonna take you with me I don't know if I'm gonna be able to film too much, but my workout doesn't change between when I'm bulking or when I'm cutting. It's just like I'm doing compound exercises, I'm trying to lift as heavy as I can, I'm doing like progressive overload, whether it's like increasing weights, increasing sets, going heavier, doing drop sets, uh, doing time under tension, it's pretty much the same. Uh, the only thing is that I increase a little bit of cardio, like a little bit more cardio, so instead of doing like 10 minutes, sometimes I do 15 to 20 minutes, 20 minutes max and that's it. So let me take you to the gym and let's go. So the first exercise after warming up with the dumbbells is the bench press. now moving on to the last meal of the day the post-workout as I explained in a previous video the potato it's so good because it, you can fill it up like this and this is basically 200 grams of potato so we're talking about like uh, 35 grams of carbs I make it with the air fryer which means that it doesn't have a lot of fat maybe 5 grams fat max to cook the whole thing and here I have 200 grams of uh, beef and chicken. Oh la la, it got a little messed up here. Let me clean it up. And here I have uh, 200 grams of beef and chicken. You can always mix it up, just have fun with it. Sources of protein uh, and my fiber. The sources of fiber, it's really important. Guys, when you increase the sugar or carb intake, you always have to take care of your fiber. Your meal always have to include fiber. Always include fiber, okay. So this whole meal probably like, as I explained, like maybe 45 grams of carbs here and I have like uh, 15 grams of fat and the protein is approximately just, uh, protein is basically just from the meat right here. So I think I have like 60 grams of protein, 60 grams of protein, 40 grams of carbs and uh, probably like 10 grams of fiber which is pretty freaking dope 
And I also have fun with um, mineral water because it doesn't have calories. So I prefer to have this than actually like Diet Coke and stuff like this. This is more natural. And uh, yeah, minerals, it's not bad to have any time during the day, right? Okay guys, that was it for me. I hope this video was informative enough for you and if there were any questions throughout the video or any things that you didn't understand or things that you want me to do in the future, maybe I can enhance my video, please let me know in the comments down below because I want to make more and more videos, more informative videos and helpful videos for you guys. Before I sign off, please make sure to give it a thumbs up if you like also to subscribe to my channel and I really recommend you to check out my website. I will have it linked in the description box down below if you want me to let you also if you are interested in letting me create a full plan for you a workout and a meal plan that doesn't make you feel hungry and deprived all the time feel free to check out my website in the description box down below until we meet again in a new video guys remember to stay fit and peace out